Hi, I'm Kate with Oars, and today I'm here to tell you all about a multi-day river trip. To start out your trip, be sure to read all of the pre-trip literature that we send you. Make sure to follow the packing list on the Before You Go document for your trip, and show up on time to your meeting location, ready for an adventure. For most trips, your pre-trip meeting will be the night before you depart. At this meeting, your trip leader will go over what to expect on your trip, as well as pass out your dry bags. You will be given two dry bags. You can think of this as your checked luggage, as well as your carry-on. Your checked luggage will be inaccessible during the day while you're on the water. Anything that you want access to during the day will go in your day bag for your sunscreen, your sarong, extra layers of clothes, anything that you might need access to. On the day your trip leaves, you'll be responsible for getting breakfast on your own, and then you'll head to the meeting location to meet your trip leader and your transportation to the river, where you'll meet the rest of your guides and they'll give you a safety talk before getting on the water. Your boat options may include an oar raft, a paddle raft, a dory, an inflatable kayak, or stand-up paddleboard. And it's common to switch from boat to boat over the course of the trip or even throughout the day. Our larger boats will be maneuvered by the guides, and while inflatable kayaks and stand-up paddle boards are not, your guides will show you how to use them. Your personal flotation device, PFD or life vest, will be required at all times while on the water, and your guides will let you know when a helmet is also required. On cooler weather trips, wetsuits and splash jackets may be provided. On a typical multi-day river trip, you'll spend roughly about six hours on the water each day. In between the rapids, you'll typically have calm stretches of water, perfect for wildlife viewing, chatting with guides and other guests, or even going for a swim. On most trips, you might have off-water excursions, where you might do a short scramble to scout a rapid or visit an archaeological site, and or take an extended hike to visit a waterfall or historical sites. Partway through your day, you'll stop for lunch and then get back on the river and head on to your campsite, where you'll unload the rafts, find a place to set up your own tent, and settle in for the evening. Camping on a multi-day river trip is definitely one of the highlights. We stay in beautiful secluded locations and have all the amenities we could ever need. To learn more about camping on a river trip, check out our video. At the end of your multi-day river trip, you'll arrive at the takeout, where you'll grab transportation back to your starting location. You'll say goodbye to your guides and your new fellow friends that you've made, and that's when you can begin sharing the incredible memories with your friends and family. If you have any questions at all about a multi-day river trip, be sure to check out your pre-trip literature or feel free to reach out, give us a call, or email us. We look forward to seeing you on the river.